The meaning of minus 1 and 1 is not what you think it is. It has a special interpretation. Let's learn about it. But first, please consider subscribing to get notified whenever I upload information packed Python programming tutorials that make learning fun. What's up internet? I am Manish from RebellionWriter.com and in today's tutorial we will learn how to reverse a string using negative indexes of the Python slice operator. Right on your screen is a code which will print the string just as it is stored in the variable. Let's execute and see. Now let's understand why. As you can see, I have not specified any value for the first and the second flag of the slice operator of Python programming language, which means for these two flags, the interpreter will use the default values. As we have discussed in the last tutorial that the default value for the start flag is 0 and for the end flag is the last index of the string. Next comes the mysterious 1. I have specified 1 as a value for the last flag which is steps. This flag tells the interpreter the interval of the elements to be extracted. For example, if I have specified 2, then every second element of the string will be extracted. But here I have specified 1 which tells the interpreter to extract every single element of the string. As a result, the string will be printed just as it is stored. Now you must be wondering what is the purpose of putting that? We can print the entire string just as it is stored in the variable even without the use of slice operator. You are absolutely right. But here I just want to tell you to bear with me till the end of this video and you will get to know how powerful the python slice operator is. Now let's come to the integer 1. Firstly, it is not the integer which is changing the behavior. It is the polarity of the integer, the sign carried by the number. A positive number tells the interpreter to process the string from left to right, whereas a negative number tells the interpreter to process the string from right to left. For example, in our case, Positive 1 tells the interpreter to process the string and start the extraction from left to right. Similarly, negative 1 tells the interpreter to start the processing of the string from right to left. Hopefully, now you understood the importance of integer 1 and the polarity in slice operator of Python programming. If used correctly, it can change the entire behavior of processing a sequence in Python. Great! Now, let's move ahead. If you will ever search for how to reverse a string in Python, then you will get the answers similar to this one. Similar answers are all over the internet, but there are very few instances where someone has actually tried to explain it. I have seen that. The lack of explanation has left many of you guys in confusion. I am going to explain how to reverse a string in Python using slice operator in detail right here, right now. So you can face your interview with confidence and not with confusion. Here you can see I have a string rebellion rider and followed by that Python slice operator. Once again majority of the values of this slice operator are set on default except for the last flag steps which is set on minus 1. On execution, the result of this code will be the string printed in the reverse order. Now let's get this slice operator down from default to manual settings. As said earlier, the interpreter processes the string from right to left if it finds a negative value for the last flag steps. Right on your screen is the index chart for our string rebellion writer. There are total 15 characters in this string including the white space separating both the words rebellion and writer. The negative index numbers for this string will look something like this. In case if you specify a negative number for the last flag steps, then the value for your first flag start must begin from the index number which is on the rightmost side of the string. In simple words, the value for the first flag must start from minus 1 and not from minus 15. Now come to the second flag and what value should you specify in this flag? Any value lesser than minus 1 on this negative index line could fit in this flag. On this number line, minus 7 is less than minus 1 and minus 15 is also less than minus 1. 
Let's say I want to print the entire string in reverse. Thus to do that the value for the first flag will be minus 1 and for the second flag should be minus 15. Yes, I said should be. Let's try. Here is the code. Let's execute. Here we got the output. If you will see the output carefully, then you will find out that the entire string is printed except the first character which is R of rebellion. Why is that so? Where is R? I will tell you the solution. But first, I want to give you a task. You have to write a program to print only the last word writer in reverse using Python slice operator. You have to comment your code. I will pick a random name and that person will win a free career counseling session on Facebook call with me. Now let's get back to our topic. As I explained in the last tutorial that the python slice operator extracts the string starting from index start to index end but not including the index end. Confused? Don't worry. Let me explain. Here is our python slice operator. This operator is telling the interpreter to extract the string from index minus 1 up to but not including index minus 15. But you want your entire string including the first character R of the word rebellion. So you ask, hey Manish from rebellionrider.com, how are we going to do that? And I say, the solution is very easy. You simply have to increment your end index by 1. So instead of putting minus 15, just go ahead and specify minus 16 and check your output. Let's do that. Now let's execute and see the result. Here is our result. This time we got the entire string printed in reverse thanks to python slice operator. That was the detailed explanation of how to reverse a string in python using slice operator. As a bonus, you got the chance to learn what goes in the background of python slice operator. Now you are ready to nail your interview. This tutorial is a complete package explaining how to reverse a string using python slice operator. So far, we have learned everything about python slice operator except why I don't recommend putting slice operator and variable declaration together in the same statement. Stay tuned as in the next video I will be unfolding the curtains from this mystery too. Thanks for watching. Do make sure to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. See you soon. This is Manish from rebellionwriter.com.